have no time to waste. Update 0.5 is out, and I have eight minutes to go ahead and get myself the new Akazo Mythic. So the battery says in eight minutes, guys, and I only have right now a small chance to get myself the brand new unit that's in the game. So if you look at the index, you see there is a 20% chance of me getting this unit, and then the other one is 2.4. So it's gonna be really hard. I don't know what's gonna be the next banner. I know the next one, of course, is gonna be getting myself Sasuke as the main one. Could get another one, but I just don't want to risk it, guys. I don't want to risk it. So I have to go ahead and start spinning. I have 50 thousand gems ready i need to get myself my super lucky my ultra lucky i can't really like i will go over the patch notes in a little bit but i need to start summoning i need to get myself these mythics and i hope that i can get myself the brand new unit oh let's go the next row we got him oh my god i was so scared i wasn't gonna get him oh my god there we go akazo has been obtained the brand new mythic for the game is absolutely awesome so i think what i learned as well i don't know if this was like fake um but if i go to collection and i click this oh i can just look that is so cool rotate left wow okay so this is so cool i didn't know this was a thing but you can go in your collections and you can just take a look at the unit so i'm sorry for a little bit of a rushed intro but guys the brand new update 0.5 is out i had to go in a rush because i needed this unit for today so quickly what they've added they added some brand new units to the banner you can see there's two new mythics as well as a few new legendary boys added to the mix as well the profile got an overall you can now customize it you get yourself different banners and different profile icons as well Raids have appeared inside the game as well. There's a boss event here for a few weeks. You can see this is the Rangoku Raid Shop. Same we will give this boss event a go because this thing looks absolutely awesome. Let's quickly do a little bit of trade rolling. We only have 12 rerolls, sadly. So I will take anything that seems sort of good. Ooh, Marksman. Okay, let's as well give you guys all the codes that are currently working in the game. There's only three working codes, guys. All the other ones have just expired, which is super duper duper sad. But the codes that are still working are gonna be thanks for 1M likes. We already had this one before. So that was for a thousand gems, rainbow as in stone, trade rerolls, and requires level 10. Then we have ourselves the code late update, sorry for a thousand gems. Boom, there we go. And then we have ourselves the last code, which could be code SLAYER for another thousand gems. Beautiful. Egros, the blood red commander. Do not assume the position of the king with only that much power. Tradeless traits disabled. Okay. We Ooh, we got a cutscene. Let's go. Okay, this is actually super dope. <laughs> Let's go. As well as so, this is an infinite wave round based thing, so... We're never going to be able to win, but let's just see. Okay, this is this is sick. Definitely 10 out of 10 quality this game. It's so cool. Okay, and there's already a ton. 3,000. Okay. Um, this definitely is probably something you want to do with multiple people, but we're just going to give it a go. Okay, let's just make sure that we get ourselves as much money as possible because we're going to need it. Let's upgrade it up. Boom, boom, boom. Get ourselves three sprint wagons going. And my three Akazo should hold it down right there. Ooh, I see that in this mode we can actually place more units than the standard three. Wait, 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 wait. Okay, 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 okay. I didn't even know that. Oh, my God. How am I ever going to have enough money for all this? How can I manage this? One of those. Okay. Now, is there, is there a boss as well? He's coming himself! The Blood Red Commander is coming in. How, oh, man? How many HP does he have? He has 380,000 HP. And this Lizard Man is gonna end my world. Boom. We didn't even get a single reward. Wow. Okay, the thing is, I don't even think that the raids are gonna go any better, but I have to check it out. I have to try. I have to see if I can take on the raid. I don't think it will go well, but you know, it is what it is. What is going on here? Why am I on an island? Where is it starting? Okay, our Vegetas are holding down the line there as well, even lighting up a little bit the area, because this this map is so dark. Holy, it's crazy. Um, now we're just going to go ahead and get ourselves our Akazo over here and get, make sure that he's max level, because I want to see all his abilities. Uh, but to do that, we have to, of course, upgrade our Sprint Dragons and get as much money as we possibly can. Okay, it's time for the first Akazo to come in. Boom. Okay, we finally have a little bit of time to look at this guy. Ooh! He's looking amazing. 
So he is a little bit slow though, but he again has the same multi-kick as Vegeta has. Let's go ahead and upgrade him so we can get Collapse. Oh, and now it turns into a one hit with a AOE ability. Okay, okay, not too bad. We have 20,000 so we can keep upgrading. I wonder if he has another ability. He should have one yet. Yeah, there we go. Look, this order for 7.3 thousand. Ooh, is this finally a multi-hit unit? Oh, it's finally multi-hit unit that has a good multi-hit at the end. Because the issue with Vegeta is he doesn't get... Like, he loses multi-hit. So, normally I was using Vegeta for that. But this guy starts with a multi-hit and ends with a multi-hit. So, you could actually replace Vegeta and my team comp. Because I was looking for a unit that did that because of the shielded units and stuff. But you can see he does multi-hits. That's so nice. Okay, let's go ahead and max him out as well. Like, he still doesn't seem too pricey and seems pretty strong. Of course, he's still a level 1 unit. We need to level him up. Like, Vegeta's level 28. Yeah, because the last ability that Vegeta has is Big Bang. And I think this, again, is just a 1 ability. We're just going to go ahead and get rid of all these Vegetas. We don't need them anymore. I just noticed we're past wave 15. Wait, there's more waves than 15 in these uh, these areas. Nice. I actually really like that. Maybe it's infinite. I don't think it is. Uh, but it's because it's a raid. It's maybe like like 30. Wait, I forgot. This is this is a raid. This is not a normal one. Wait, wait, wait. Okay, okay. Ooh, a huge threat is approaching. It's going to be for wave 20. We now have four maxed out Akazos over here. Looking absolutely awesome. Uh, we have our maxed out Vegeta as well. And we, of course, have... Actually, we have no money. Uh, but, of course, we're going to get a little bit more later on. Let's just see if it's going to be enough to take on this huge threat. Ooh, I'm going to have my, get my hands on some Marechi and reclaim the place among the 12 moons. Okay. We have Kyogun coming in. 42,000 HP. Shouldn't be a big issue, to be honest. But we shall see what happens. Oh, he's over here. He's just a small boy. Okay, okay. Uh, yeah, he should be uh, out of the game pretty soon. 42,000 HP is not too insane compared to that uh, event boss we just saw before of like 400,000 HP. This guy is, uh, is a joke. And there we go. We can see the big hits. It's only one hit. And that's what uh, my issues with Vegeta upgraded. Like his starting is really good, but his end is really like luster. It is what it is. And there we go. Is that the rage is fully done? We got... Eight secret we red webs as well. Okay, some gold. Okay, not bad. Of course, there's more axes, more areas, but I thought that the event would be a lot easier and the raid would be a lot harder. But yeah, that's gonna wrap up the video for today. If you guys did enjoy, hit that like button down below. Guys, subscribe if you're new. Of course, comment down below what unit you think is the best one from this brand new update. Have you managed to beat yourself? This brand new boss event, I think it's very, very hard, but it's definitely possible if you're a lot higher level and maybe even have some uh, some better units because I have no evolved units, etc. I should dive into that, uh, but yeah, we'll maybe do the next time. So if you have enjoyed, hit the like button down below, guys. Subscribe if you want to see you guys day today or tomorrow for another video. So stay guys. Take care, love, bye. Thanks so much for watching, and of course, as well, take care, guys.